How does the new G36 play? This is what I'm going to showcase in this video. The G36 is a new assault rifle that will be available to attackers with update Operation Blackdown, and it's supposed to provide them with another CQB-oriented weapon. With a mag of 30 bullets and a decent rate of fire, the G36 deals a fair amount of damage. In the current work-in-progress version of the build of the update Operation Blackdown, the G36 deals the following damage to the head and the chest. Okay, we're gonna start without any mods, see how it goes. And we're gonna be doing 130 to the head and 30 to the chest. Then we're gonna try with the silencer and the red dot. And we are doing 127 to the head and 27 to the chest. And then we're gonna try with the flash hider and the same red dot. We're doing 128 to the head, 28 to the chest, and then with the compensator and the same red dot. We're doing 127 to the head and 27 to the chest. Pretty good. Again, remember I am recording all of these from a work in progress build, which means that the stats you're seeing right now are subject to changes since the team is still working on the build for the update. So things might change once Operation Blackdown update gets released. So I'm going to be playing a co-op mod solo with the G36 and the Glock 17 on Terror House, just to showcase how the weapon works and how it feels and how it sounds like. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so here we are. Um, Terror House, Hardcore Difficulty Solo. We are going to take the G36 that I modified earlier. We're gonna go with the Glock 17. Uh, with the micro and the compensator, and I think I'm gonna go with two flash grenades on this one Just in case the hostage is in a room that is a bit tricky to breach And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spawn it back right And then we're gonna lower our speed right away and go in single fire By the way, you've got one speed Per stance, so right now I'm standing. I have my my speed, which is at the lowest. But if I crouch, I have a different speed setting, and the game remembers this all the time, right? So if I want to if I want to be fast when I'm standing, I do this, and when I want to be super slow when I'm crouching, I can do this, and then the game remembers all the time. So, oh shit. Alright. Very, very aggressive, these guys. Oh, by the way, I unlocked my first watch. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty cool. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just gonna check this corner here. Just in case there's someone. But I think it, it was just this one I just killed. We're gonna check this room from the outside. We're gonna take our time, slice the room properly. Door is open. Both doors are open. We're gonna have a lot of enemies in there. We're gonna... Warn them. I go down. I hear doors opening. Some of them could go out as well. This one is down. I hear steps. Ooh, doors opening. I'm gonna show you the animation when uh, the operator reloads the uh, the G36 as well because it's pretty cool. I like just uh, how it puts the mag in there, but it's best when the mag is empty. So we're gonna empty a mag and I'm gonna show you the animation. It's it's pretty cool. Oh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> the game didn't want me to uh, shoot this one. By the way, I've got the laser sights on me, so if you press T now, you can turn it on and off. 
while before it was always on if you had night visions equipped. But because it's a weapon detachment now, you can actually interact with it, so it's pretty cool. Okay, toilet door is closed. No trap. Let's keep checking the left side. It's pretty tricky because the main door is open. Gotta check like this so that I have an angle on the right side as well over there. There you go. I don't think they would push more. I think that might have been the last one in the stairs. Yeah. Checking mag. Three left. Alright, let me show you the animation of the G36 when your mag is empty. Ah! <laughs> Just love the way he just puts it in the in the receiver. <laughs> it's very well made. I like it. Now I'm gonna go back outside. And I'm gonna clear the rooms from the outside. And I think that's that's the trick on this one. You can do a lot without getting into the rooms. We gotta make sure that there's no one on the balcony here. We're gonna take our time. Slice properly, take our time. No one so far. There will be people though. Hands up! There you go, there's one. There you go. It'd be so cool if we could have blood splatters on the wall as well. Like more realistic uh, special effects. Maybe in the future. I think the red dot is not really centered as well, and I believe that has been reported already. So, some of the stuff that you see in this build, obviously, still need to be fixed. And the devs probably have fixes for them, but they haven't updated the build yet. So, don't worry about these. Okay, I see, I see a flashlight, but I don't see any, anyone coming here. So let's just make sure this room is clear. I think it is. Okay, good. Okay, let's see what we have in this one. Take my time. Oh shit, two of them. <laughs> have fun with this. Oh! A bit bad boy. That's not what I wanted to do. Don't think I got him. There you go. Alright, check the balcony here, doors open. No tango so far. Hmm. Oh, over there. Bullets in the air. Oh! What a mistake! Well, that would teach me. <laughs> Always check your mags. Okay, let's keep going. I've got tens alive. I'm gonna use my. No, I'm not gonna use my flash on this. Bullets, hands in the air. Bullets, hands in the air. Down. Okay. So one thing, by the way, you can. Oh, my mag is empty. Okay. But uh, if your mag is empty, you can collect weapons to actually. Refill your mags, so that's pretty good. Get down, hands in the air. Let's play in full auto for a bit, so you see the the rate of fire. Uh, 
I think I'm missing one health stage, if not two. There's one here. Oh, both are there. Hello. Okay, so whatever we find now is hostile. Shoot on sight. Cool. Okay, so we've got the two hostages. They are on the third floor. Or second floor? Second floor, there you go. See something over there. See, it's uh, it's actually a pretty good rate of fire. Actually, it's it's quite an aggressive weapon. It's actually pretty pretty efficient. Got three alive. That's right, I'm gonna toss my mag. <laughs> okay, this one is giving up, so that's pretty good. I'm missing one. Unless another one gave up. And I, I don't see him. Or, he could be hiding under a bed. Which is often the case as well. Yeah, there are. There you go. All right. That was all of them. There you go. There you go. All enemies have been neutralized. Voila! All right, let's have a look at the at the score just for the fun. 94. All right, I'll take it. <laughs> so that's it for this zero hour video showcasing the new G36. Again, remember this was recorded on the work in progress build. So some of the stats, maybe even animations might change in the final version of Operation Blackdown update. I am pretty excited about this update and we haven't seen everything yet. I think this new G36 is pretty fun, but let me know what you think in the comments below. If you liked, G36, leave a like to support the channel. I'm Scott Hot Rod of the World Foundation. Thanks again for watching, and I will see you in the next video.